All right, everybody. I appreciate all the comments and everything on the videos. This here uh, is going to be a really fun video. Uh, I've been waiting uh, to highlight some of these. I haven't even done, as I mentioned many times, cleanups on a lot of these finds, which these, of course, are my display quality finds, whether it's the Guilfords or my favorite points, or whether it's nice uh, quartzies, as many people call them, which I have down in here and all around here. And I also have a bin for older stuff, I think, which I might get to sometime. It depends. Uh, there is a, there has been some uh, interest put in this bin. Now, I've emptied pretty much all of it and put it up there, and I want to show everybody today uh, in what I think a lot of guys around here call sugar quartz. If my focus is working. And uh, they've made so many different types of points out of what we call sugar quartz. To give a look at all of these things. Most of the really great ones are up top. But it's a really cool kind of granulated quartz if you don't have that kind of stone. Uh, and they're in that bin. So as I do that, and show everybody a glimpse of what I have for my, my best points made out of sugar quartz. Look at all of these styles. Unbelievable. And I'm going to go through them. Uh, I'll probably go through them largest to smallest. It's just what I had thought. And uh, mention some things as I go. Just give you a tour through the sugar quartz points and get them as close up as I can so you can see the, the granulated nature of the quartz. Look at that. It is granular and it feels that way, but they could make a lot of great things out of it. And I'm just going to go through these so you can have a look at this kind of uh, stone and material. Of course, these came from all seven sites, and it is it's in North Carolina, eastern North Carolina here. The sugar quartz is very available, or was really available. And as I go through these points, look at this one. I do want to make mention that uh, these are all just beautiful points made by beautiful people. Names, God knows, because I don't have any one point that's the same as another. Similar in style, yeah, I mean, look at this one. We have points that are similar in style for sure, but they're all different. They all come from specific individual personalities. This is just a smoker, isn't it? Man, this was a good find at the bear. Look at this piece, will you? Just a great find. Granular, too. Has that granular feeling. That was just a great point to find. Anyway, go right up here. Anyway, as I was saying, um, and get a good look at these, this does have some rose color in it and what have you. Every one of these points was designed to bring in food. And it wasn't like they were going to show these points off or anybody really cared what they looked like in terms of what other people thought. What they got notoriety for and what they got recognition for is bringing home the bacon. <laughs> we want to realize that um, sociologically. They got notoriety for what these points could bring home. The animals, the food, the sustenance for their mates and their families. And uh, whatever points got the job done and whatever points uh, were successful, they probably repeated, that's for sure. You see all these different styles in sugar quartz. Look at this smoker. Unbelievable. And so that's just the way that works. It's funny. Names are great. Don't get me wrong, anybody. Uh, but I just like to think of them as just beautiful uh, arrowheads or beautiful points. Made by beautiful people. Look at this thing. Their utmost um, consideration was that these points would do what they needed to do. Look at that thing. Get right on here. Look at all these different styles and sugar quartz. That these arrowheads would do what they need to do to provide the food they needed to provide. And uh, they continually adjusted and changed every little bit of the style of uh, arrowheads that they made. They wanted things to work, to work efficiently. They wanted to use the stone in whatever way the stone... Uh, work best, they went with it. 
And, uh, you know, that's my soapbox. Uh, I don't mind categorizing them like this one. All you guys might look at that and say, oh my gosh, that's a so-and-so. I don't know what it is. Whether it's a LaCroix or whatever in the world people call them, it doesn't matter. It's a smoker. It's a beautiful point. I think it's an older one, isn't it, guys? Then this one. Nice points. This one at the bottom, it's just missing a little off this side right here. Just a little, but it was such a nice point altogether, and you can see that. Sugar quartz. And the last row here, small ones, size of my fingernail. Look at the workmanship on this. Nice stuff. Nice stuff. Give me an idea of the size on these. <laughs> Look at my fingers. Look at the size on these. <laughs> Look at my finger now. These are smokers. Small stuff. Great stuff made out of sugar quartz. Anyway, beautiful points made by beautiful people. I wanted to share the sugar quartz that I have. It comes in all different tones, brown tones, gray tones, pink tones, but it's clearly all the same stock of rock. Anything you can tell me about this type of rock, I'd love to hear it. I don't know about it. All I know is I find it, and uh, I'm glad to have it. And the last one in this, this collection is this, in terms of display. And I pan back out and get my focus working. And there you have it. Just happy to have this as, a, as an individual sort of set. I'll probably make a frame out of these points uh, that are made out of sugar quartz. And uh, that would do it justice one day. Anyway, as I get ready to split... I want to thank everybody for watching. Uh, any comments you have about what I think is called sugar quartz, which you're looking at, I'd love to hear it. I don't know enough about it. I just know it's a different type of rock, so I put it in a separate bin. And the funny thing is about this system right here, uh, which, which I spoke about and shared with a lot of people, a lot of people think it's a great idea, is that down here where that came from, one bin, there's points in it, and all of these points fit in there with room to spare. That's pretty cool. Anyway. Thanks for watching, everybody.